How you doing? Another late night update. Uh, I've finished all the electrics in the base and I'm getting very, very close to finishing it soon. So I'll um, give you a close up of what I've done and just take you through the last few things we've got to do, okay? Okay, so here's the electrics cavity at the back there. So I've uh, wired up the three pots and the output jack um, and then installed the pickups, the green and the red cables. Uh, my pickups, black and the white, are the dummy wires. Um, it's sort of like a humbucking idea. Uh, I don't know if you can see that, the metal rod there, that's my uh, bridge ground attached to the tone pot. And I've got that coming out through the top as you'll see in a second. So that's all done and ready to go. And... Alright. Here's my top, so the pickups are in. These are my Damasio Ultra Jazz pickups. And my three. I've got a volume a volume and a tone knob here. I tested it today just by tapping on it with a screwdriver and it all worked through and out very nice. There's my grounding wire coming up there that will attach to the bottom of the bridge and finish that circuit for me. So that's actually all ready to go now. Um, the neck has now got its true oil all done, all finished along there and I've installed the hardware. The one real disappointment I had, the um, sorry, get that glare out your way. The D tuner doesn't seem to work for some reason. I flip the lever, and nothing happens. Nothing moves on it. So I don't know if the mechanism itself is busted, or if I simply haven't thought of something. But I've written them a, a, a note on their website. I've um, sent a message to them. Hopefully, they'll be able to give me some advice on how to get that. So in the meantime, I've just posted the standard four tuners on it. Uh, there is my bridge, I'll give you a close up on that one because it's really nice. There's my Babbitt's full contact bridge, so I can get the glare out your way. And there's the contact point on the bottom for that grounding wire. Bit of a process to put that in though, in order to install that you've got to remove the saddles entirely to screw them in. It's a bit of a thing, so I might try and shoot that when I do it. Um, I'll probably try and do that tomorrow. We'll see how we go. But otherwise we are very nearly finished. I've just got to actually assemble the neck to the body and then put strings on and set it up. And we should be good to go. Okay, thanks guys.